I love solar panels. Solar panels give us the ability to harness what's out there, the sun, and to turn it into a useful form of electricity so that I can make my pizza in the oven. Now, the issue often with solar panels is that if you've ever seen a solar panel, it's lined with glass. Now, if you've approached modern solar panels or had the privilege, if you run your hands over the top of a solar panel, you'll notice that it's not completely flat. It's got sort of ridges and stuff in it. And those ridges are there for a reason. What we had originally when we were producing solar panels is that a lot of the solar rays that entered the solar panel were actually being lost to reflection. If you've ever seen a piece of glass, often you'll get reflections in it and if you can see the reflection like i can see i'm looking at a window right now i can see a reflection of the trees behind me it's because there's some of that being lost not all the sun rays are getting through the glass which is what we want in a solar panel we want all of it to get to our solar cells now we took inspiration from the humble moth if you've ever looked at a moth's eye up close you'll notice that it has a lot of sort of like ridges on it and this has developed over thousands probably millions of years so that when predators look at it in the night they can't see the reflection from its night vision coming back at them and this sort of saves it from being the i don't know what eat, eats moths the chameleon's next meal and we've taken inspiration from this by creating little ridges in the top of the solar panel we can reduce reflection and allow us to capture more of the sun rays without losing it back into the atmosphere